This is the only way I can grow Vandas here. That would be something, huh? She's bound to stay. <laughs> and also check this out. Now that is an Oncidium. What a display. I wouldn't have an issue growing this one either. But shall we go and check and see if there are any real ones around? These are our orchid offerings in one of the bigger garden centers. It's all about the fowl. And it would appear that the swirly spike configuration has also reached southern Spain. I'm not sure I'm a fan of that. But to each their own. And you can see there's not really that much to offer. I mean, she's pretty. I'm not saying they're not pretty, but you see, our orchid selection is extremely limited. And just out of curiosity, let's check the price of these beautiful fowls. $22.95. No decorative pot included. But then there's other tables. Sometimes they have other ones tucked away. And here is one. Oh, I'm already seeing. I love this cute little yellow one. Look at that. That is such a cheerful color. I absolutely love this one. And the blues are waxy. And let's have a look. See, let's just see what's going on here price wise. Excuse any dirty hands that you may see. $25.50. I know she probably has a name, but there's no name on this pot. But $25.50. You can tell that they consider this a special one. And yes, she does stand out from the rest because also the structure, the texture, the feeling of her blooms. So much different. But she doesn't have a fragrance. She's adorable, though. I love that yellow color so much in the spotting. But we have pulsation. She's not as vibrant yellow as this one is, but you know, I got me a yellow one from the dumpster. But then we look a little bit further and then we have Oncidium and another Oncidium. Very sad little Oncidium. Can't rescue them all. And then, if we want to keep going and keep having a look around, I mean, this little mini fowl, isn't she just adorable? Like, that is so cute. <laughs> oh, she is such a nice, happy bloomer. 22.95 euros for this little one. And then we have more Oncidiums. And then another Oncidium. And then, that's it. More white fowls. 
over there. That is it. No wonder we have to pay shipping here in southern Spain to get what we would like to have because, yeah, variety is not the spice of life here. Not when it comes to orchids. But I just saw something just as incredible. Look at this. Ooh. Ooh, I love this. $33.95. Philodendron white variegated. Okay. Probably has a proper name, but look at what's coming out here. Ooh, mm, mm, mm. That's beautiful. So we'll have a little bit of a goo, a little bit of a gander. Ah, I guess shipping is easier when you get the spike to go down that way. Now that looks pretty. Uh, this wavy, weavy S-shaped thing. This looks nice. I like that. But let's have a little bit of a gander and see what else we can find, what else I can show you in this most magnificent of garden centers. I am absolutely blown away. And if I had the space, this would be coming home. Well, <laughs> space and the budget. This is Alocasia zebrina, and the cost of this gorgeous, gorgeous plant is 116 euros and 75 cents. But oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I mean, can I repeat myself? Oh my goodness. <gasps> Oh, I love the texture, the structure, the patterning, whatever. I'm blown away. This is beautiful. But we don't have the space, thankfully. And we don't have the budget, unfortunately, because other goodies are in here that won't be coming home. We can just gawk at them. Amazing. A Miltoniopsis in southern Spain. This is why I don't grow them. And no, I would say even though it's in the garden center, it's stressed, it probably doesn't have any roots and all that fun stuff that we know about. Even if I took it home, there is no chance it would survive. So why they keep bringing these orchids in, I don't understand, but okay. Just wanted to show you a classic example of a Miltoniopsis in southern Spain. A lot of emphasis on fake plants here.
while I used to grow hydrangeas, I don't grow them anymore. But this right here is my color palette. Gorgeous. Just gorgeous. I hope you enjoyed the little stint with me to my garden center. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Thank you so, so much for joining me and for watching. Have a beautiful rest of your day. On that one condition though, please, that you stay safe. Take care. Bye.